Hey everyone and welcome to my channel, it's Coralie D here. So today I decided to make chocolate orange date balls. So here is the recipe and how I made it. Hope you enjoy! So we're going to get straight into it by slicing up each of the dates just to make sure there are no stones in there. Sometimes you can buy dates that have already been stoned but it's a good idea to check just in case. Today I have 12 dates. We're going to place the dates into a small pan, then we're going to pour some boiling water over them and let them soak for about 20 minutes. This makes them super juicy. Drain off the water and put the dates into your food processor or blender. Give it a quick spin and then add a handful of walnuts. Give it another spin and make sure the mixture is pushed down at the sides so it can all blend nice and easily. Give it a few more pulses till it is more or less all blended together. Then go ahead and grab an orange. Now I really really like it super orangey so I'm going to use half of this orange. If you don't like it so strong just use a quarter of an orange. And yep I use the rind and the juice. Now go ahead and grab some cocoa powder. Add one quarter of a cup and pulse till all is mixed together. Add a dash of vanilla extract and pulse. And then finally add one quarter cup of desiccated coconut. Blend all of the mixture together until it's nice and sticky. Now, this is the fun part. Take a small amount of the mixture and roll it into a bowl using the palms of your hands. Then, you're going to roll it into a bowl full of desiccated coconut till it's completely covered. Repeat this process until you have run out of mixture. <laughs> Don't worry, it washes off really easily. As you can see, these delicious chocolate orange date balls are so simple and quick to make. They are perfect for breakfast, having as a snack, a dessert and even great to take to a party. If you're like me and cannot wait, you can go ahead and enjoy these delicious treats straight away. Or you can freeze them and enjoy them later in the day. I really hope that video helped you and I really hope you go and try and make them at home yourself because they're so so tasty. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!